Dire Team Ban. Radiance Pick. So everyone's gonna all chat here and gonna have some fun. <laughs> Pick. Okay, first pick from my mere feet is Outwardly Devourer, the traditional I'm gonna win mid pick, but <laughs> Trainee just says screw you guys and he just picks up Razor and fucks up the pick of Outer Destroyer, Outer Destroyer. So I'm gonna have a really, really, really hard time on the lane here. Radiance pick. And second pick is Timbersaw. So Trainee is uh, mad and he's going all out versus these guys and he picks up Timbersaw's second pick. And now, I'm your feet are in trouble. They are thinking hard about what they want to pick next. They should pick up the support heroes. They should pick up Rubik before it's still in the pool. They should pick up uh, Visage while it's still in the pool. To go. <laughs> Radiant team ban. They actually pick them up. Okay, they actually go for a Lich pick, which is not bad. Considering he has the most highest win rate in this recent patch. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Reserve time. Okay, they're even taking reserve time for these bands. They have no idea. They have no plan here. They are just randoming and whatever that comes to their mind is deciding. Dyer's ban. Radiance ban. So, okay, the death band out fear and death band out barrels from death band out darks here, so pretty standard bands. Uh, except his fear and ban. I don't really gel with it, but they still ban him. Ten so, whatever. Whatever floats the boat. Five. Seconds. And the big bands are still underway. It's a band phase, second band phase, last band. Uh, I'm your feet bands out Rubik and Dire Strats have banned Enigma. I wonder why they banned Enigma, they don't want the combo combo or something. But it's so easy to counter Enigma. It's not even funny right now, but they, they still ban him out. And Dire Strats go for a Shadow Demon pick. There is, it's a really, really, really strong combo with Razor. So can just link up and Hero can come just come in and disturb and get additional time and extra damage uh, suction from the enemies. And Dreddy is going all out here and he picks up a Mirana, another combo hero with uh, Shadow Demon. And they have the perfect setup here. They have everything they want to bring down any hero they want to whenever they want to. I mean, it looks like to be in trouble here. They, they, pick, they did pick up a Mirrorunner, but I'm not sure where they want to lane her. As they already have a Lich and OD. OD is most likely gonna be mid. Mirrorunner off lane, and well, actually, Lich should be off lane because he's like really, really good at off laning right now. But I wonder what they're gonna do with this Mirrorunner. They might even run her as a support rail lane bottom, but that's a bad idea considering the bad changes. That there's a lot less experience in the lane. Venona is a hero which needs at least level 6 to be pretty good. Or to be really useful in the game. Go. Okay, still a level of his shackle shot at oh, first second. and try to do some damage that way, but it's pretty hard if you're not experienced with that hero. Dreddy's last man was alchemist, you don't want to give a strong carry to the uh, arm your feet.
10 seconds to go. 5 seconds. Sorry about the lag, guys. I had to do something quick. So I mini the game. Dyer's pick. Dazzle. Radiance pick. And Freddy goes for last pick of a dazzle. Oh my god, he is going all out here. There's another combo with Shadow Demon. So Shadow Demon is going to be like Krista Hero here, doing everything up, and it's a, it's a first word guarantee for Freddy. When I get the first blood. Uh, and I'm your feed actually picks up Weaver as the last pick. And I have a Doctor as well, which is a really, really weak hero versus all the heroes that uh, Dreddy has picked up. So now I'm gonna announce the players, guys. It's Ellie playing the maybe we were here, Blue Exorcist on the Outer Destroyer, Dino playing the Ledge, Justice on the Winner, and Grizzly playing Witch Doctor for I'm Your Feet. And on the other side, uh, their opponents is Dire Strats. Dire Straits, sorry. Their opponents are Dire Strats. I'm. God, I'm sleepy. So, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be Dreddy playing the Razor, Rocket Knight on the Dazzle. Cruz on the Virana and uh, relax. I'm a champ. A shadow demon. While Cleaver is gonna be Timbersa off lane. Sorry, Timbersa easy lane solo. Four team. Sorry, four, four members of uh, Dire Straits are moving down here into the enemy jungle, trying to find someone here. And the Cleaver is actually standing at the tower, so he's not gonna get cut out. And it seems to be a dual lane mid. No, actually, I think Lich is just here to deny a creep, then he will move on to wherever he wants to go. Winner is the uh, top lane. Solo, yes, and it's gonna be a trial lane bottom, most likely. It begins. And here we go. Pass creep denied by Lich. I wanna see how much experience it gave him. It gave him 30 experience to him and 30 experience to Outward Destroyer. So 60 experience in total at level 1 actually, even before starting, so that's pretty good. And that experience is denied to the enemy team. An illusion rune picked up by this dazzle. Is he gonna try and bait something here with this little rune? The Radiant team has actually no ward on the map. So they have no clue what's lying in wait for them. Here, I don't think they even realize that Shadow Demon has a big combo. Uh oh. Shadow Demon Reception comes in, comes in, in comes the arrow, and yes, that's a dead ledge. First blood, as I said, would go to the way of Dire Straits. The combo is just so good, and it's just such an asshole combo that you can't really do anything against that. If they want to focus one guy down, they're gonna focus him down so easy, it's not even. It's not even funny. It's nearly child's play for them here. Uh oh, and they're gonna go on this Witch Doctor. Witch Doctor is dropping pretty low. He's taking last hits. For, he's taking hits from the illusions from everyone else, and that's a dead Witch Doctor. This Dylan needs to be in a big, big trouble here. But in a lot of trouble here. They're pretty much screwed. And now the game depends on the mid lane and on the top lane to perform well for the Radiant team to actually be able to win. Dreddy is actually playing Razor mid. This is is OD and I think he knows how to play that. And he's gonna take full advantage of that OD and rape him. The weird thing is that he did not go for a boost. Which is what you need when you go against a OD. So chase him down and to suck up all the damage from him. I wonder what he's gonna get as first item. He has enough money for a boots if he wants to get them, but I don't know, he's not getting them right now. He's still saving up money, and I hope to god he does not make a bottle. It's useless as fuck on Razor. Uh, looking at the CS charts, it seems like Razor and Timbersaw are tied, while Mirana is in third place with 5 last hits. Got 
This one's coming out. Uh oh, another initiation. But arrow misses and... Okay, actually that poor fish doctor is trapped between his illusions and there's no way he was surviving that. Weaver is giving some chase. He wants to get a kill on the... Uh, Dazzle, but... Uh, Dazzle is just gonna walk away from there. They even have a war down, so... If uh, Weaver tries to get cocky, he's gonna get raped. So they have to play really careful here, as the entire team is much more experienced. And they actually know what they're doing. Uh, Lich is gonna rotate back home. Yes, he's going all the way back to the base while this poor weaver is all alone here. There's a rotation coming in to towards the top lane. But there's some fight going on in the middle lane. Razor taking a ton of damage from a ton of damage from the Outworld Destroyer, making it pretty hard for him to hit. Uh-oh, uh -uh. uh -oh. Vinona seems to be in trouble. You still didn't walk to try and get away. Is she baiting this uh, Imbersa? I don't think so. She does take a lot of damage though and drops to half HP. This timber can now just dive and fuck, and fuck her over. Doctor uh, stun went out, lost two times, but it's nowhere enough to do anything here. Bottom is missing. Actually, Razor has doubled the last hits as OD, so he's doing pretty well for himself here. He's gonna win mid. Actually, he has already won mid just because of the pick, and the last hits has guaranteed that uh, it's his win here. And the bottom mid Australian seems to be dominating everything which they get put up against and it really causes that the support heroes abandon their lane and they're going top now and trying to do something here with the uh, Timbersaw but what they don't know is that Timbersaw is such a tanky hero that he doesn't even need to be controlled here he can't be controlled he's nearly level 6 and when he's level 6 his uh, intel supports are so dead In comes a uh, disruptor and a dazzle for that mid OD. OD actually imprisons himself, but he's like, gonna take so much damage because he's his ultimate and he's gonna just gonna die here. This game is another stomp, like all these games in the tournament have so far been stomps. And this looks to be a stomp as well. I don't I don't know why it's like that. I think that the skill level is just too low of some people. And the half decent team can just stomp them. is missing. Weaver meanwhile on the bottom lane has nearly no last hits. Only 10 last hits in response to Mirana's 18. And yeah, he's pretty screwed here. Misses the last hit there on the creep as well. So he's having a lot of trouble problems here. What does he have on himself? Actually no items yet. But he had a thousand gold in the pocket. I don't know what he's waiting for instead of buying items. He's just put just keeping them there. Meanwhile, on the top lane, this Shadow Demon and Azul are closing in towards that. The winner and... Uh, no. Is it Lich with him? Yes. No, actually Wish Doctor. But they, the Wish Doctor and the winner decide to back off as they thought it would be quite unsafe to stay there anymore. So they're gonna get away safely here and this rotation is gonna go towards middle lane now and try and find a kill on this Obsidian Destroyer but he actually has a Babysitter as Lich right there standing behind him. It's going to be pretty damn hard to bring down two heroes here by diving the mid tower. Uh -uh. Middle is missing. Seems like the Radiant team is so passive right now. They're not able to do anything. Mirana ultimate being used for some weird reason. So I think they want to gank this OD. Getting in position here, trying to pay that OD to come near. The Razor. That seems to be ready, but no, it seems like that the 
dive support are just gonna back off here and they are making their way down but this ward is gonna sc scout them out making their rotation pretty useless unless this weaver is a complete idiot and stays there and in that case he's just gonna die but he actually asks for support and in comes Fenrir with that teleport and I wonder what she can do here to save this weaver for long Top is missing so far and the dire the radiant team is just playing super safe right now while the dire team just is trying to do something and try to get something done and get more kills with their rotations but lack of smoke is hurting them here so much that they are just seem to be wasting their time right now pretty one actually has his items up pretty pretty fast And it seems like there's mana boots up on Dazzle already, while uh, Razor and Mirana have their face boots. Radiant team only has power threads up on the Beaver, while the other teammates only have brown boots. Oh, they don't even have boots right now. So he's in a bit of trouble here. If he gets skanked mid, he's, there's no way he's gonna be able to run away for long. To run away far before he just gets caught out by Shadow Demon and Mirana or Dazzle. Razor trying to dive a bit deep, but I wonder what he's trying to do here because he's solo here. Okay, he's actually gonna tower dive this OD, taking all his damage here. Okay, ultimate being used as well. The OD is taking a lot of damage and just two, Razor just two hits. That Ophelion Destroyer, no way for him to survive. Because Razor is maxing out his uh, unstable current which gives him extra movement speed. And combined with uh, the face boots, it's pretty deadly because you won't be able to run away from him. And he can just follow you around. Radiance Middle Tower is being attacked. There were some letters on the chat asking about the stream link, so I had to give it to them. This is gonna be farming away here. Mirana is leading the net fourth by yeah by around 300 gold over the razor. The razor seems to seems to be having a really good time. Metal getting this OD raped, fucking him up, zoning him out, making him have no damage whatsoever. This OD keeps astral imprisoning this razor when he links but what he doesn't realize is that it slows him down so much Radiant's that uh, razor actually Radiant steals more damage rather than actually giving any I, I bet he's just scared of getting tower dived again like the last time so he, he's playing it as safe as he can uh oh Who's Doctor Ultimate being used, but just nowhere enough damage to kill that razor off who is uh, 900 hp and He's well on his way to make a BKB, I think. Radiance bottom tower is being attacked. On the other side of the map, the tier one tower bottom is gonna be pushed down by the dire team. Radiant Three people committed there, and now they're just gonna walk away here. But I, I think they're gonna turn around into the jungle and try to look for some more kills here. For heading off somewhere totally different. The only guy they can find right now is Lich. And Lich have actually heavily warded this jungle. There's a ward here, and then there's a ward here. Okay, actually, Razor dived uh, over Destroyer again and owned him. So this game is looking really, really tough for the Radiant team. They're 0 8. And I also don't see a way for them to catch up. 
don't have any killing potential here. I like the Riot team who has big combo between their heroes. I'm pretty screwed here. We are being really aggressive here. Uh, fighting this wave past the tier 1 tower. Trying to push that tower down with his teammates here. But I don't think it's gonna be enough. And he will have to back off from here for now. He will drive his luck again in a few while, in a few minutes. Uh oh, in comes Invasor with a link on Minora taking all that damage from her. Oh, sorry, 56 damage. And he's trying to chase down someone here. Will, be, will they be able to find Outer Lich Tribe? My Anna ultimate is used already. Oh, the second comes in on Venerer. Is it gonna be a dead Venerer? Okay, late heal from Dazzle. And that caused the Venerer to just get away scot free here. Oh, actually, Timbersaw got a kill on Witch Doctor. On the top lane. This Timbersaw actually came from behind, and now he's so strong that I don't really think that the, that the Radiant team has a chance. Maybe even less of a chance not now to win. Versus this uh, Dire Strike team, which is absolutely destroying them every, from every single side again. Okay, double damage wound being spotted out by Dazzle. Let's Bottom is missing. Radiance bottom town. <sighs> and I'm getting really tired, guys. Great I'm gonna plug in my wireless mouse and I'm gonna lie down for a second while I cast. Radiance bottom tower is under siege. The luxuries of having a wireless mouse is that you can actually go to your to your bed, lie down in it, and then cast from your bed like a boss. Oh, instead of having to turn around or sit on the on the chair all day. I have my tablet with me, so if any of you have any questions, you can feel f you can feel free to ask me no, on uh, the stream. Sorry for the cam, it went all over the place. Okay, so we are gonna take a look at the mid lane here. They are trying to push down that tier 1 tower. We either have a DD run up on him. Outward Destroyer is already dead, as is uh, the Witch Doctor. Uh, this is, yes, tier 1 tower. Nearly uncontested, save for the mirror, so save for the Winrunner. Winner arrow which tried to do some damage and tried to uh, push them off, but it wasn't much. So now they have to back off even more, while the dire team is actually in the side in the jungle trying to hunt something down. Okay, planks already coming out. I did I find someone here? No, there's actually no one here, but. <sighs> Army of Eid is uh, actually getting ready to defend this tier 2 tower here, but it's pretty damn low. Miran ultimate is actually used and they are scouting out ahead, trying to oh, find so someone who just steps out. Oh my Easy god. Defense. On the other hand, this Razor just found someone on the top lane. This actually was a ledge, and the poor ledge just melted to this Razor. Now he's gonna find a Invis rune. And he's going around looking for Radiant some more food. He's actually already used, so I don't think he's actually gonna dive anyone right now. And he's gonna wait for his ultimate. Actually, there's a fiend team fight going on in the Radiant Jungle. Wow, I think Obsidian Destroyer finally got a kill. And now it's 214 in the favor of Dire Straits. Still, oh my god, nice arrow from Mirana. Catches up in a Mineral Stunned up, taking a ton of anti damage from uh, Razor. Oh my god, big ultimate from Lich is bouncing, is bouncing around, hits that Razor and forces him to run away. In comes Seaver, is hitting that Razor for uh, as much as he can. Uh oh, Mirana Arrow misses that Weaver just by an inch. Weaver is running for his life here. He has nothing with him except only power touch. And now he's trying to pour out, but... Oh god, he nearly died to that Razor. Was only last hit, I guess. Top tower is that Razor would have gotten a kill on the Weaver as well. Bottom is missing. Radiance top tower is under attack. 
This is the hardest part of being an impartial announcer. Balancing how little I care about anything that's happening here. Radiant's top tower is being attacked. Radiance top tower is under attack. I know it's not a Radiance bottom tower has been destroyed. Radiance top tower has been destroyed. Wow, well, actually two towers were taken down. One by Timbrosaur and one by his teammates bottom lane. They did try to catch out that uh which doctor. Sorry. Is that this is that is uh, actually what? Who is that? That's actually a doctor. Yeah, they were trying to catch him out, but they didn't. And they did. Were they did not have enough burst to kill him. Radiant's top tower is under siege. Then. Radiant's top tower is being attacked. Get this. We're on our as again with the arrow, and that's a dab on our PKB user, by the way. The razor is diving deep. As an imprisonment being used on himself by all of you, so trying to buy some time, but this razor is absolutely melting everything in his path here. My arrow size of hit three or your is 90 HP, and Miran actually lost its set with, with Weaver. It was actually her kill with the arrow and everything, and she decides to just take it. Mark it as hers. Top tower is under siege. Dyer's middle tower is under siege. Radiant's top tower is being attacked. Radiant's top tower is under attack. You're really losing now. Or winning. Well, back to my mad libs. Radiance top tower is under siege. Dominating. Great teamwork, you vicious thugs. Is missing. Radiance top tower is being attacked. Radiance top tower has fallen. Godlike. Great teamwork, you vicious thugs. here. I guess with all them, but I'm not sure. This seems to be an absolute stomp here, guys. To be honest, this Razor is just owning everyone here. I'm just tired of seeing him own everyone. Just last hitting everyone. And destroying everyone he can. Radiant's middle tower is being attacked. I'm actually pretty sleepy right now. I'm lying in my bed and I might fall asleep. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. To the jungle. <sighs> God, why is he increasing the game time here? Just 
it's just wasting time here, guys. Is why doesn't he just go and then just end this game instead of dragging it out? That from my tablet is not working, so I'll have to come close to the uh, to the PC again. But it seems like they want to push me again and try to take go get those tracks finally. Okay, run on the is used for some reason. He has his uh, scepter up and he's going to work on that tower. Tower is falling pretty low. For the mission is still there. It's not up. Razor used his BKB. Oh my God, he's tanking that Witch Doctor ultimate. He's diving in a bit deep. He's linked up uh, Option Destroyer from my guess. And that's a dead Option Destroyer because that's gonna be all the damage he has been taken by Razor. Razor throws the ultimate out, but Timbersaw gets a double kill because of his pure damage output. That's a dead tower. Are they gonna go for more? Yes, they're gonna try and get this Lich as well, who's low HP and he's running away for it just for his life. Oh my god, poor Lich, and he's dead. I guess we'll kill him, he's totally sick here. Now they're gonna try and get this Raxus here, but this Razor is still trying to get some kills here. He's trying to rape with the enemy at the base rape. He tries to get a shackle from the Twitterer, misses, and Razor is just gonna walk away. Radiance Middle Barracks has fallen. I'm starting to think this was great teamwork. Delicious. This is genocide. Double kill. Windrunner returns. Radiance Middle Barracks is under attack. Radiance Middle Barracks has fallen. Well, these guys are so fighting instead of just ending. But finally, the Middle Barracks are gone. It's still there. He does get a kill on the poor man on our VHP on Godlike. This is just a massacre, guys. Disaster. Big disaster. That's what it's game one. And it's finally a GG call from Mirana. Radiance top tower is being attacked. Ready, just owned everyone here with this razor. There was uh, what really has to bad pick from the radiant team picking up Option Destroyer so pick. And now they actually learn how ridiculously stupid it is to pick Option Destroyer versus a razor. I hope to god that with this Russian they go on the high ground and then they finish this game up. Just being dragged out for no reason right now. is absolutely melting everyone with his ultimate. Come on guys, just call GG. 
Top barracks is under attack. Great teamwork, you vicious thugs. Trick you. Radiance Middle Tower is under siege. Radiance Top barracks is being attacked. Radiance top barracks has fallen. Unstoppable. Radiance bottom tower is being attacked. Not that I care one way or the other. I'm starting to think this was great teamwork. You vicious thugs. Radiance bottom tower has been destroyed. Radiance bottom barracks is under attack. Radiance bottom barracks has fallen. Radiance bottom barracks is being attacked. Thanks. Radiance middle tower is under attack. Radiance middle tower has fallen. Radiance middle tower is under siege. Radiance Middle Tower is being attacked. Radiance Middle Tower is being destroyed. 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 Radiance Middle T